my channel welcome back to vlogmas day number 13 on lucky for some today i promised i would bring you a shopping haul now i haven't been out mad shopping and i did promise i would bring part of it as a primer curl but i actually left my bags my two bags in the back of my friend's car haven't had a chance to get it so that'll be coming again but i have some stuff i got from jensky from Choices and Home Savers. So they're the three I'm going to bring you this evening and I hope you enjoy it. I will try, I don't have a receipt for all of them, but, um, sorry, I'm just taking that out of my way. Um, yeah, so without further ado, we'll get into it. I'm actually going to start with Jensky because I only got two items from Jensky. So every Christmas I buy myself a light or some sort of some sort of light I suppose I could leave up after the Christmas. I love lights, I love twinkle lights, I absolutely adore them. So this year I got myself this. It's an LED candle and I don't know if you can see up here. You can see it moves and I'm just going to turn it on. So it's actually like a real flame, flame effect candle and it is 18 hours off, 6 hours on. So that's what I got. They were actually reduced to 750. So I got myself two of them and they can go on my mantelpiece or I'm actually thinking I might go back and get two more. And put them on the inside of my bed. But yeah, that was that I got. The other thing I got was a Christmas tree set. Now these are ceramic. They're really nice. This was, I think, reduced down to 750 from 13 euro. Now they don't come with batteries, so you have to go out and buy your own batteries, which in fairness, it was probably a bit of a flap. Oh my god, I can't get them out of the box. Okay, have it out of the box. It's that polystyrene, you know, the stuff that goes absolutely. Sorry, I'm looking a bit flushed because I have spent all day pulling out stuff, pulling down stuff from on top of, on top of wardrobes and also for that we spent the day decluttering the kids came home they've done their wardrobes and stuff so we've just been working hard now i don't have the batteries in these but this is literally what they are and there's three sizes so this is the smallest then you have this size and then there's a bigger one i'm not going to take out the bigger one on top but I thought they'd be nice and they, there's a little LED light in it and again I would keep them beside my bed happily all year. I don't think it's timed. I'm trying to see if it says, oh indoor it does. It says you can have six hours on, six hours off, two hours on and, 12, and ten hours off. So that's the way it works. It tells you that down the, the bottom down here. So yeah, so we'll see how we go with them. They take, oh, I did stop and buy the batteries in Choices. And that's the batteries there. They take the CR, the C2, or the C216. No, that's the wrong battery. That's the battery I wanted to get for them. So I'll have to take those two batteries back and see if they'll change them. Oh, that's annoying. Anyway, so that's what I got from Jensky. Now Jensky is a, I think it's a, a shop from Denmark and it's meant to be like direct competition with uh, Ikea or the Danish. Oh, do you know what? We were cleaning so much today. Um, I just can't wait to get into the shower. I have my heater on in my bathroom. I'm just dying to get into the shower and just because I feel I'm covered in dust and ugh. so 
we will move along. I'm just going to leave them there because I'm afraid they'll break. So the next shop, well, the next shop I went to, this was sort of done over a course of a few days because I never actually went shopping per se. I sort of run into a shop and come out and that be it. So for those of you who don't know, out my back I have a shed that used to be on stilts and the men came and they cut it down. And it's also where we store our skeleton, our Christmas, or not Christmas, our Halloween skeleton. And his name is Bob. And yes, I've met Bob on a few occasions. So I decided that in a video, I asked, will I decorate Bob's house? So a few people said yes. So in choices, I got Bob some, if you can read them, LED timed lights. And they're for indoor or outdoor. And they're battery operated. So they're they're on a timer and they, it doesn't say how long the timer's on for. For indoor, outdoor, 60 day. Oh, it's on for six hours and off for 18 and repeats every day. So that's what we're going to put on the outside of Bob's house. So I'm going to get the kids to help me do that and put Bob's, the lights on in Bob's house. Sorry. So we also got, these are all in Choices. Choices is an Irish store. Um, I don't know what its equivalent would be like. Maybe like Poundland or... But that's deals. I'm not sure, but Choices anyway. I like I like them. They tend to have what, generally what you're looking for. So we got some command hooks for holding up Bob's lights. And then seeing as Bob was out in the back on his own, I mean, he can see in the window, he, you know, he, he's quite close. I bought him a hat for Christmas and a cut out. Try and keep him warm. So we're going to go and we're going to put that in Bob tomorrow. I think, I think I'll get one of the kids to go out and do that. But that's, Bob has his hat now and his lights, so he's set. But I still have to move the stuff out there. That's what I was uh, out for storage in the shed from the kitchen and the pantry that's what I'm doing but I haven't moved it out yet because that's what we we're pulling at today what a fluff so the other thing I got in choices actually do you know, I'll open one of these is for Christmas Eve boxes for the kids now my kids are big kids they're 16, 17 and 21 and I was saying to them you know I think these uh, things need to stop and they were like eh, no why, why would you stop giving us a Christmas Eve box so why would I stop giving them a Christmas Eve box so what you do is you buy them they come in a pack and this comes flat but if I open this out I'm just going to show you here if I can get them out actually a little box and that's the box comes flat packed but that is the box so in that box they will have their pajamas and they will have a little treats and that's what I do up for the kids for Christmas Eve now I will their pajamas and stuff are in the pennies bag that's in the back of my friend's car so I can't show you them, but I will show them to you. The other thing, if I can... I'm in my bedroom where I have all the sweets. Okay. So this is the other thing I have for... It smells gorgeous. I have for going into their Christmas box. And that is a chocolate bomb. You can see it there. It comes with a stirrer stick. This one is a Terry's orange. There's the orange chocolate orange piece. Chocolate bomb. So I have them to go into their Christmas Eve boxes too. So they just get pajamas, maybe a pair of slippers if they need them. This year no one needed slippers. So it's just pajamas, chocolate bomb, goes in their little box. They're happy. So yeah, so I went up to choice, so I bought three of the Christmas boxes. So I got this one. This one actually says Christmas Eve box. 
and it has a put the right way up. What's it say on it? Special delivery, especially for you. So they only had one that said Christmas Eve box. So I got the pink one. I got the Christmas Eve box. And then I got you know, no, that just says Christmas gift box. But I got it, it's like a reindeer type effort. So as I said, literally, and I mean, I've done this for them for years. I remember doing one for Kerry when she was like a baby. Well, not a baby, but you know what I mean. Um, and I've always done it. And the kids get more kick out of this on Christmas Eve. Normally we go out Christmas Eve and we go maybe look at lights or just arse around. Then they come home and these are on the table for them. And they run up and they hop in showers and they come out and they get on their new pyjamas and they do a, And I, I swear it gets more exciting the older they're getting. Um, it, it's really funny because when they were young they'd get them and they'd be like, oh Christmas box. Now they're like, can't wait to get our Christmas box. And it's like big hype up. And now obviously because they're that bit older they're staying up, they're watching movies, they're doing stuff. So yeah, so maybe I'm, I'm worse. I should say to them, no I'm sorry, these are too old, get lost. But I don't. I enjoy it. And I actually enjoy the fact that they enjoy it. So, that is. That's all I got. Sorry, in choices. Just, just moving my pillow because I'm sitting up here in my bed. Okay, so the next shop I went to was a shop called Home Savers. Sorry, I'm going to turn because it's a big bag to pull across. Now, there is some food in this bag. There is some food. Can't get comfy now. So in this bag, there is some food. It's one of those, I think it's like a, is it a B&H store they have in the UK? And they've opened up in Ireland, but they've opened up under Home Saver is the name, I think, in Ireland. So I like them. Um, yeah, I've seen them, people post them from all around. But yeah. So there is a couple of little presents I got for Kerry in this. Now, one of them I have to bring back and change. A bit of a flaff, but anyway, we'll go through it and I'll tell you them when I come out. So what I got for the kit. Now, Hayley was with me because we'd been to the orthodontist. So she was with me. So a couple of things in here are because she was with me and we, we picked them up. So the first thing I got them was Winders Apple and Strawberry. So they were five bucks, five in a box. The other thing I got was some elbow grease. I actually love this cleaner. I actually think it's brilliant. Um, yeah, I use that quite a lot. So we got that. Then my mum has only recently discovered that she loves Monster Munch. So um, we were up in, as I said, the Home Savers and we got our big box, a big packet of the uh, Hot and Spicy My Mighty Munch. That's there. Hot and Spicy Mighty Munch. So the other thing I got from Home Savers was the Death All Machine Cleaner, the 5-in-1. This is a kills bacteria, prevents bad odours, prevents lime scale, removes hidden dirt, a lasting freshness. Single-use lavender for my washing machine. I'm just putting my hand in and pull, seeing what comes out. Now this is one of Kerry's stock socking fillers. So I will do near Christmas, probably go up on Christmas Eve, what I got each of my kids. Because as I said, they do tend to watch my videos. I know Kerry watches them, Carl's an admin, so he watches comments and stuff coming in for me. And uh, it's actually funny because I know if I post it, it'll be the one video they will definitely watch. So I'm just, she knows about this because she needed this for work. But... Um, I will be posting a video probably Christmas Eve um, as I'm wrapping the presents of what I got each of my my kids for Christmas and probably what I got my mum as well. So 
So this is a face mask. And it says Friends. Carrie's mad into re-watching the, the Friends series. It's funny, I remember it the first time around and I didn't think it was that great. And Carrie was downstairs the other day and she put it on. And watching it for the second time, it's still not that great. So, but look, keeps her happy. Oh yeah. So this is a cup I got her for um, her sock as well. Now it says Joey. I have to bring back and change this because it's not Joey she likes. It's Chandler. Chandler. Whatever his name is. So I know she'd be fine with it. But I'd rather bring it back and change it into the right person. So that was that was three pounds, which is about three fifty we say, three fifty four euro. Um so it's not that great. Not that dear. So I just want to see if it's um Empty contents, caution, mug, wash for suitable for both use in the dishwasher and the microwave. I usually always check that before because there's no point in buying a mug if it's not good for the dishwasher because in my house everything goes into the dishwasher. So if it can't be washed in the dishwasher, it'll never get used and it'll end up in the bin. So I got her that. Oh yes. So I got this then. This is a metallic blackout single curtain panel. It's 54 inches wide by an 86 drop. Now I got these for between my sitting room and my office area because it's just one big long open room. And in the winter, there's only one radiator in the room so it's quite chilly but I have the fire on. But there's a draft. Every time you open the door to come into the room, the draft is unbelievable. So I thought if I could use this curtain and just cut across the middle, divide the room, sort of, that it would cut down just on some of, your, some of the draft between the rooms. So I got that. They were only, I think it was 15 euro. And I didn't think they were that bad. Here it says, warm in winter and cool in summer. Totally blocks out light and eliminates drafts. That's all I wanted to do. Actually, I wonder if they do it in a smaller drop for my bedroom. Um, I never even thought of looking. When I go back to change the cup, I look. That's what I'll do. Jeez. I'm a genius. So now I just have to ask my friend to hang the curtain round. Do you ever be sick asking someone, not sick asking someone, would you ever be asking somebody to do things where you're sort of like, if I ask them to do another thing, they're going to think I'm just totally incapable of doing anything. We're reaching that stage. So then as a treat for my mum, I got her a big 12 pack of Monster Munch. And it's 12 roast beef flavour, 12 or twelve. Okay, it's been a long day. It's four roast beef, four pickled onion, and four flame it's flaming hot. The flaming hots in these aren't very flaming hot. They're they're actually nice. They're nice. So we'll keep going. Oh, okay. So this was for me for driving in to collect my mum. Um, it's about a four hour drive and sometimes I get a pain drinking a hot coffee all, you know when you're getting tired you, so I got myself some moose juice it has caffeine in it it's an energy shot rainbow candy is the flavour and it said it's with, <laughs> with sweetener and zero sugar so four calories and that's it there so it's just a little oh that's all the that one's out of the way there so just a little caffeine shot so driving to my mum's I'd probably have that there's only so much coffee you can drink all right guys so the next thing I got and as I said some of these were just random items we picked up 
I picked up my hot and sour soup. I love this. I re it's an Ainsley Harriet. It is only mild, so. But I like it, the hot and sour soup. The other thing we got, and when I saw this, the kids I used to drink this all the time in Spain, when we lived in Spain. And it is Simto. Now, as I said, my kids haven't drank this. You cannot buy this, I don't think, in the in Ireland, in the supermarkets. Um, so, can you get it? I think the only place you can get it is Iceland. It's the only place I've seen it and this home savers. Um, but you can't get it sort of in the mainstream supermarkets. But my kids love this, so I did pick up two of them and they were chuffed. Apps, I managed to keep one because they nearly had the other one drank. It's a dilutable. So, now the thing I did get for Christmas dinner is I have big salts, you know, the big grindy salts. So I wanted a little um, salt and pepper for the table. And I got these ones, they're just little mason jar ones. Now I am a bit worried about the pepper because the holes at the top of the pepper look quite big. And if you've got fine pepper, ground pepper in there, I don't know if you'll be able to see. That's the pepper they have in it. So it's a really fine pepper, but they're the holes that are at the top. So I actually think they'll come out quite fast. So I don't know if I should put a slightly more coarser ground pepper into it, um, but then they mightn't come out at all. So I don't know, I'll have to try. They are, I don't know why I'm doing this on my bed, opening pepper. Oh yeah, they're sealed, sorry. Well, they're not really. Well, they are, but they're not, if you know what I mean. It wouldn't take much for it to fall off. I don't want pepper all over my bed. So yeah, so that's the salt one there. Again, as you can see, it's fine salt and there the holes at the top of the salt. But I just thought they'd be cute as opposed to having the big grinders on the on the table. Now this is a bit of an odd one. When we were up there, Haley loves um marmalade but she loves like a, a strong obviously marmalade is made out of orange but she would be quite fond of before we got a lemon marmalade and she really liked it the jar is a bit sticky but this is one she asked me to get while we were up there and it's a lime and lemon marmalade and there's nice cuts of the what you call it? What do they call it? I don't know if you can. Let me see if I can get a clear bit. The rind, is it? Is that what they call it? Anyway, so it's a lemon and lime fine marmalade. So that's made in Leeds. But yeah, so that was Haley's Haley's choice. So that is it, lads. Um, they were the three. Three, yeah, three shops I went to. I did go to Penny's, but as I said, I left the bags in the back of my friend's car. Jesus, do you know what? I'd forget my head if it wasn't attached to my body. So I will bring you that as soon as I, I'll probably go up maybe tomorrow or the day after and get back the, the bags and I'll be able to show you then the pyjamas I got the kids for Christmas. Um, I think a few stocking, stocking fillers I put in there as well. I can't really remember. Oh, and yeah, some stocking fillers and two storage trays for them that they're getting for Christmas, the two girls. So that's hopefully coming one of the days, sort of once I get them back and then I record the video, blah, 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 blah. But at the moment, I'm in the middle of decluttering my kitchen, dining room and above that big wardrobe. Carl has started doing his room. We have so far between Carl, Carl and Hayley share a wardrobe because Hayley's in a box room. They have got three bags of clothes to donate and two bags of rubbish out of his room. Well, he's rearranging, he's decluttering, he's doing all that. Kerry is starting on her room tomorrow and I am going to start on my room. If not tomorrow, then it'll be the day after because I need to finish off the kitchen and the dining room. So guys, if you like this type of video, remember to give us a big thumbs up 
hit the notification button and if you feel like it, can you please subscribe it is totally free to do it's no cost to you but it just lets me know that you like the content that i'm putting out right guys i'm gonna go and i will talk to you tomorrow take care bye bye